Yo, what up, traders? Got another red day. My red streak is continuing. Got two day red days back to back. But really, just because of commissions, I really was green. I made 12 bucks, but commissions ate me up. I was green, then went red. Stay tuned. <clears throat> Yo, what up, traders? So, jumped in there at 508. Started off the morning, the morning very, very good. But uh, just didn't walk away when I was supposed to. I actually walked away, made my money. But I came back to the market to trade, literally cause, because I was bored. That's why I traded, and that's why I have a loss on the day. Anyway, I jumped in here at 508, pulled back to these uh, VWAP levels, 9 EMA on the 5 minute chart. In, in VC was my first stock I traded today. It was, it was pretty heavy. The, the level 2 is thick. This is a high flow stock. Took it off for a quick scout. Up 9.72. Not bad. Same stock in NVC. Pull back down here to this uh, psychological support level, $5. And it's at the VWAP. So that's why I bought that. I bought that 5.04. I'm in too high. I wish I would have got in right about now. But you know what I mean? That 5.04. Just try to just I just really I'm just scalping this stock. Like this is really I want to scalp it now because it's exactly like it's gonna be backside, especially with this 15 minute wick right here. So I see I like when I took this trade, I saw this wick here, and I was like, okay, um, this is a a risky trade because of that wick. And um, so I was just trying to scalp it. We ain't trying to hold for the real 10 cents here. And I think I do scalp it for like a couple of cents. Look how heavy! Look how heavy level two and time of sales is acting. See, not even go with the all those greens thickness. It's, it's very thick. Stocks getting crowded. Nah, I, I I traded very well this morning too. <clears throat> I broke all my rules. I traded at a time I wasn't supposed to trade. You know, I closed down my broker, opened it back up. Just to say, just to look at the market, and I still trade it. Uh, so annoying, man. Still waiting for the push up. I'm up nine bucks, only up three cents. This is very slow. Still waiting. Nice little biz at five oh seven, but the you know, level two is acting slow. It's acting slow because of that wick on a 15 minute candle and then we have some lines up here above this candle here so that's acting as, as acting as resistance so i got it at 509 i really wanted to get out at 510 didn't get it i'm up 17 bucks on the day <clears throat> now i was trading at work today so i miss a lot of plays that made me i guess over trade like that i miss a lot of plays so FCEL, we got markets finna open up 17 bucks. Just double checking. Markets finna open in a couple of seconds. Like, this stock was a nice stock, man. It ran up pretty nice. And I missed a lot of plays on this stock because I do IT. Someone came in with a computer problem. I had to stop and help them. So ready to dang trade forever and quit that shit. Anyway, thank God I got a job. But anyway. So this 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 stock is too little. I want the little. I want to pull back some more. I want to pull back to that six that six fifteen six twelve level. The VWAP is all around the same area. Like if you look, the VWAP here is at six twelve. VWAP here is at six fifteen fourteen is. This one here is like six fourteen thirteen something like that. So they're all matching up. So that's a high y'all play. So <clears throat> I'm looking for a trade here, and it's coming down to start a little bit. Something there at six fourteen. This way here, I actually waited for the rip because I felt like the rip was going to come. Especially with these levels down here. And it's already starting to show some rejection to the downside with that bottom wick. So I'm holding on to this because I feel I, I, I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm going to get the rip. Even though it's going against me a little bit, I'm still confident. It's not flushing down. It's not flushing down violently. So it means we got some buyers trying to hold it up at the VWAP level. Get a good, get a good rip. Get a ten cent pop. If I held all the two, if I held up for twenty six, I'd have probably been done for the day. <clears throat> so 
Six fourteen back at my average. Six sixteen, six seventeen. Look at the bids. It's 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 it's, it's acting heavy, but it's not. It's, it's still going up. And right now it's acting a little heavy right here. See how it went down, back up at twenty. Got through that that wall at twenty. Once we got through the wall at twenty and broke, I knew I was gonna get my twenty four, my uh, my ten cent um average. Got out right there, boom. And it actually pushes up nice. I didn't capture any of these trades, and I forgot to um. I forgot I had to edit it. I didn't edit it right, but I forgot to lift up my uh my thing to show you my um my top my uh my P and L. Hold on. So squeezes up my P and I'm trying to show you my guys P and L right now. So right now I'm up after that trade I just took, I'm up forty bucks on a day. All right? Looking pretty good. I'm up forty bucks. Next trade, I'm down 28 bucks. So, um, I, I do apologize, man. I did not capture those trades. Actually, I did capture it, but <clears throat> like I, I got some losses in here. But when I was recording and when I closed down my uh, my editor, look at this here. Hold up. So I'm gonna let you guys know, like everything crashed. Like these are some these are some of my losing trades right here. Like especially like it's just dub duplicated and everything crashed. So. I lost all of my losing trades. I don't have no losing trades, so I'm, I'm sorry I didn't show you any losing trades. But I will show you the chart that I took trades on and I lost. So, discard that. Discard that. Let's look at the chart. I was on, um, what stock this was? This is FCEL. Let's play it out. Let's see what happens. So I'm down 28 bucks, down 30 bucks. And I should have quit right there. I should have quit on the day right there. This trade right here, this trade right here put me down 30 bucks on a day. So I should I should have been done. So anyway, you know, down. So down right there. Sorry guys, let me get my uh I'm gonna show you the chart on my loser. So it was F C E L. So I lost here. F C E L. Still get no pop. Right here in this, this this area right here. That's where I took this trade. No, was it here? Yeah, right here. So I took two more trades on this stock on F C E L and I got red. Took trade right there and right here. This level right here. So I was gonna bounce, didn't bounce. I got I I got a little green on it. Right here. Took a trade, went against me. But I just didn't. I just didn't take it off. I thought it would get a little squeeze up to at least the seven dollar level, but it got to seven ninety eight. I was in that seven six ninety six. That's only two cents, so I really couldn't take that off. I really want that pop above seven. Didn't stopped out. Boom, fell. The next trade on FCEL that I lost that put me down. There we go. Where's that? Right here. This stock here put me down. Uh, is it this one? Okay, that the last one I showed you, that stock put me down. I was up twenty four dollars on a day. When I lost over here, I was up uh, forty six. When I lost over there, that the first um, trade I showed you, my first loss over there, I was only down twenty four bucks. This trade right here put me down negative thirty dollars on a day. Right here, trying to play it again. See, nice little wicks right here, but there's just no momentum. The volume, the volume just gave out. I don't know, man. The volume did not come back. Try to play a bounce. Went against me. Dump. Boom. Sucks. And I was on that. That was those two. Those two trades. FCE and I took some more trades on BLU. And um, let me see. Yeah, right here. And this right here put me down sixty dollars on a day. Is it this one? I think it was this one. Yeah, I think after this I quit. I just I was just done. This put me down sixty on a day, man. Bought it trying to buy a bounce. I should have probably waited down here, but as you can see, there was no continuation bounce, so this was just a dead play. This is just not a good play. Not a good play. Trying to play a bounce up. Didn't never bounce. Got in at five ninety seven, went to about six oh four. 
I, I mean, on, on, when I took this trade, it was times it was at like six dollars. I could have got out at six dollars, but it was three cents. I, I mean, I guess I should have took that instead of just taking a, a, a dump like that. Got dumped on miserably right here. <sighs> yep. So that makes my PNL for the day negative sixty dollars and seventy nine cents, and that makes me. I was up pretty good. Now I'm down. I'm only up thirty bucks on the day. Accuracy went down. I was up like I had eighty percent accuracy to the day. Lost ten dollars yesterday. Sixty dollars a day. Yeah, working working backwards, man. But at least I'm still green on the month. Still got to you know. <clears throat> like my 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 game plan is to stay green. This live account, like you no, know, I want to make some money, cool. But not right now. Not with the shares I'm trading. I can't wait to make no real money with the shares I'm trading. I can. I can say with the shares I'm trading, but really with my account. Because I can't retake really like big losses. I got to scalp. got to get in get out. So, yeah. I'm just, I just, I, with this account, I just want to just stay alive. Like, I want to grow it, but I just want to stay alive. I don't want to. I want to keep this account. I don't want to, like, freaking blow it up. Anyways, money games. Thank y'all.